five women have been strangled over the past three months. The murders are clearly premeditated. It's a pattern they'll almost certainly repeat. Yes. Boston Strangler is inspired by a true story about the search for a serial killer through the eyes of two female journalists. My character, Loretta, is on the lifestyle desk and is desperately trying to be a serious journalist. Three women were strangled over the last two weeks. Women were being murdered and nobody was taking it seriously. Loretta McLaughlin went to her editor and said, I want to cover these stories. And he said, why? It's a bunch of nobodies. You don't have a story. How many women have to die before it's a story? Loretta and Jean team up and they both get equally obsessed trying to get to the truth. Got any leads? The guy's as careful as he is deranged. It took two women to highlight the case in such a way that people actually took action. Now they're actively pursuing this killer who's at large. And just like all the women in Boston, they were deeply, deeply afraid. Their pictures were in the paper. They were getting death threats at home. Hello? Loretta and Jean really have to fight to get to the truth before time runs out. Unless a centralized effort is set up to catch the strangler, he will remain a faceless, formless, flawless executioner. <laughs>